are many invisible symptoms with multiple sclerosis, which make things very difficult. Other people see you and think, oh, she looks so well, you know, she looks great. Oh, you know, there must be nothing wrong or she must be fine. And they assume that, um, that you have enough energy to do something or that you're able to do the same things everybody else is because you, you look okay. Unfortunately, with multiple sclerosis, most of the symptoms are invisible. You know, you're always tired and there's, there's no way of making up for that tiredness. I have a lot of difficulty speaking at night, but then towards the end of the day, it's difficult for me to say certain words that I'm, that I'm thinking. So I have to think of another word to say that is similar to that word. So other people can't see that, but I'm sort of having a bit of a struggle with a conversation or reading something out loud. I have a lot of problems with the pins and needles in my, my feet, um, and I don't have any feeling in my right foot up until halfway up my, um, my shin. I also have a lot of problems with like going to the toilet, like an urgency, um, not being able to go. There's lots of things that you, that you can do to make things a bit easier or manage your time well. I've done more things than, than I had done in the previous 10 years to that. Uh, I plan my whole week. So I know what things I'm gonna do on what days. Um, and I've only got a certain amount of energy for each day. So I don't plan more than one or two things on each day. And I spread it out really well. If I have a day that I'm not feeling great, then I won't do anything else that day. You know, my one you know, chore might be to get up and get my son ready for school and that's, that's it. Um, and I find that if I listen to my body really well, then I'm, then I'm not too bad. Uh, but if I don't listen to my body, then I get quite, get quite tired and that's when I tend to relapse and, and become really unwell. Having MS, I found for me, made me really look at my life and look at the things that were really important to me and to my family and to my friends.